Hello! Welcome back to the channel, folks. Glad you could make it. Oh, if you're new here, just want to say welcome. Make sure, before you leave, hit that subscribe button, ring that bell so you know when the next video pops up, give that like button a big ol' smash, and before you leave, drop a comment down below. And also, if you're one of the regulars, welcome back. Glad, glad you came back again. I ask that you smash that like button, and before you leave, drop a comment down below and both of you guys and everybody share the video share 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 we're at 154 subscribers at the time of recording 200 by the time Kenobi drops May 27th okay so we're gonna do a shout out and mix in with the hashtag keep talking segment here and the shout out has to go to salty nerd podcast um, first off congratulations guys 5,000 subs, great job. Um, I was on a panel for their five for their 5,000 celebration. It was really good. They've been they support me, and really, this is kind of where this all thing started from. So, if it, so, if you want to blame someone, blame the salty nerds. Um, they also kind of spearheaded the idea for the the name that based on my first based on on my first based on my first. Bit, in idio, um, they like they really liked the keep talking, keep talking, which then spawned the hashtag keep talking. So again, Salt and Nerd Podcast, thank you guys. Um, look forward to doing more stuff with you guys in the future. And now that that's done, the reason why we're here, episode five, coming to an end of Moon Knight. All right, this is the third act. Here we go. Now, to be completely fair, there were some things that this episode got right. Minor things, but still big thing, but still enough to make me notice, so I want to point those out. So, just being fair. Um, in this ep episode, we got some um, highlighted and more prominent um, acknowledgement of Mark Spector's Jewish heritage. Okay? Uh, we had a few little clips, like a new rock stars found a book and a very small, in one of the, the mirrors of Stephen, you could barely see the Star of David. So, but here it's very, in a few scenes, it's very pro prominent this was a lot of backstory and flashbacks because we all love we all love flashbacks don't we so and then we see mark's childhood home obviously it's it's in america is it new york sure let's call it that why not um there was um also in the flashbacks when he and mark and steven are going through the psych ward to go through their memories where Mark makes makes reference to his to, to his former the military career also with that his former partner Bushman okay and then they showed the the moment when he becomes the Moon Knight when he gave finds the te temple of Khonshu Contra give gives him the powers. He gets the suit. So and then we we see the we see again the character Moon Knight for about five seconds, and then um, we get to see from the um, that Stephen was part of Mark's psyche ever since he was a, ever since he was a child. Uh, I was highlighted in the Jeff. Lemire run. Thank you, Danny, for pointing out that particular storyline. We'll never get that name out of my head now. Thank you. And this was based because of an abused childhood. Took on abuse from his mother, and so he formed this other persona to kind of shield him from it. Um, also with his mom, there was the callbacks to the first episode when Steven's saying, Later Gators, when he's on the phone, talking to his mom, but his mom has been dead for some time. So, 
This is all callbacks to episode one. Okay. Um, we saw the um, scale of judgment where Mark and Stevens, their heart is being weighed by the feather of feather of uh, scales of justice with the feather of truth. Um, I'm not sure if that's the actual goddess that um, was in charge of that. Um, Danny from Comics and Cosmic Edicts would know more about that than I would, just saying. Um, and then on their way to the Gates of Osiris to go back to the um, real world, we see as the hippo god goddess is not is saying that unclaimed souls have, are just falling into the underworld and this is wrong, this is evil. Has Amit already been re released? Could be. I don't know. And then um, at one point um, Stephen gets tossed off the boat and gets frozen in the sand. It's at that moment when the scale balances and Mark's soul is at peace. And instead of going back to the real world, we find himself in the field of reeds, which is um, life, the spend the rest of your life in paradise. So kind of like heaven, I guess. And that's where the episode ends. We got a lot of questions that still need to be answered um, for this for this f finale. Because does Mark go back to the Earth realm? As has Ahmet been released? I, 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 I got nothing. Um, I will say that by far this episode was the most engaging episode for me. Is it too little too late? Can this series be saved and turn around for this, ep by this episode no not for me it ha not not for me and it just goes back to too much stuff previously that has been done with the characters Stephen Grant Marlene slash Layla um, Crawley uh, Ethan Hawk Arthur Harrow uh, mr. Knight Still, no Jake, no Jake Lockley. I really wanted him to show up, guys, because I know a bunch of you are really hoping that this was the episode. I wanted it for you. Uh, and just the series as a whole, just a lot more of that MCU nonsense. So... We will see. Um, I don't know. I mean, these series have started off. I mean, they've some of them, some have started okay, but every single series has had a descending trend from series intro to series finale. Every one of them, and that's not a good trend. So, we will see. But, until next time, when I see you guys again on Saturday, or sometime earlier if something pops into my brain, but we'll definitely be, I'll see you on Saturday for another little Saturday short. And, yeah, thanks for stop, stopping, by, stopping by again, guys. So, as a reminder, remember, subscribe, smash that like button, and drop a comment down below, share Share the video. And yeah, I'll see you guys on Saturday. In the meantime, have a great rest of your week. 
always have fun, hashtag keep talking, and always keep that smile on your face. <laughs> Toodles!